Hi, I'm Bruce Gearing, Superintendent for Dripping Springs ISD, and welcome to my podcast. One of the things that we're trying to do in the district is connect students to their interests and passions. And in that pursuit, we have opened up several new electives at the middle school level, one of which is a Myth Solvers class, based basically on Mythbusters program on TV. This class at Dripping Springs Middle School has signed up two full sections of 30 students each, which shows you how students are connecting to their interests. Let's go and have a look at the fabulous things that are happening in Dripping Springs Middle School. Hi, my name is Aaron Caps. I'm the eighth grade science teacher and myth solvers teacher, as well as boys athletic coordinator at Dripping Springs Middle School. This year we have a new elective called Myth Solvers, which is a wonderful new class. We have two sections of it. It is basically we are taking everyday myths that you hear and we are either proving them or debunking them by having our students go through the experimental design process. It's been a wonderful class, a lot of student-led and student-driven curriculum for this class this year. Uh, we're really excited about it here at Dripping Springs Middle School. I'm really excited because it's also opened up my professional connections. I've actually reached out on Twitter and I've had conversations with Adam Savage, which is one of the Mythbusters guys, and uh, he's given me some great ideas about viral videos that have really helped our class. Our purpose today is to see, does practice make perfect? How many of you have heard that saying, practice makes perfect? That's a chance now. Okay, so we're going to see if you can do a physical task and get better at it. Okay, does it make perfect or do we just improve? And we're going to figure that out all together doing the same activity. In the Myth Solvers class, what we do is we take a viral video or a common saying and we test it out. And today we use the saying, practice makes perfect, and we dealt cards and see, like we're seeing how fast that we can like deal the cards and improve. I really like this class because it has a lot of the freedoms that kids in my grade need and we also get to choose our own myths. We make our own designs, our own experiments. Our, it's very free to do our own choices. It's interesting to watch our teachers taking risks in the classroom. Coach Caps in particular is reaching out to students to really understand what they want to do next in this class. I suspect that next year he may not be teaching anything other than Mythbusters. Thanks for listening. Have a great week.